Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Carlos here, Good Smellers, at Element Showcase. I have a bit of a cold, so please excuse me. I sound like Harvey Firestein today. I'm here with Cecile Zorokian, a new up-and-coming perfumer that is in hot demand right now, and uh, here she is. Hello, everyone. How are you? I'm good, and you? I'm very good. So uh, you're a bit of a big deal lately. Sorry? You're a bit of a big deal lately. Oh. You have a lot of <laughs> projects out there. Oh yeah, it's been a, it's been good. Yeah. A good year for you. Yeah, a really good year. 2013 was an excellent year, actually. So what do we have? We have um, MDCI perfumes. Yes, New Andalus. I haven't tried that one yet. I really want to. Okay. Um, and then you have the uh, Olfactivo, Laboratorio Olfactivo. Exactly. The um, which was on you. It smells lovely. Yes, <laughs> thank you. Tell us about that. What's in what it's is that? It's called uh, Cash Noir. Cash Noir. Um, and it's um, it's an Oriental uh, perfume. Um, so you can have a really ambery dry down, but also. Um, um, but they're really uh, spicy at the um, mm. top. I mean, you have a lot of coriander and also a bit of lavender. It's beautiful. I tend to prefer orientals. It smells lovely on you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, it's not there yet uh, in the U.S. I heard it's coming in the, mm -hmm. in the few, in, yeah, I mean, next week maybe or... To uh, Min, New yes, York. at Min. You guys yes. know Min. And the same for uh, Nuit en Andalus uh, at mm -hmm. uh, Oswald. Oh, cool. Yeah. Two of my favorite stores, <laughs> and Twisted Lily. So, um, where did you get your training, or when, where did your passion yeah. come okay. that you wanted to be a perfumer? You knew this was the so field for you. For me, actually, it was uh, uh, pretty late uh, because at first I, um, I did some uh, uh, medicine. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, in Mexico, really? uh, and um, I met uh, someone uh, who was at uh, the school that I did uh, later. And she talked about uh, what she has done, the, the, the perfume industry. Okay. And so that's how I, uh, I uh, became really interested and wanted to do that. How many years ago was that? Um, I think I was something around, around 20. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so you've been doing this for quite a while. Uh, no, but I mean, I was just, um, it's uh, two years, uh, it's a master's degree, mm -hmm. actually. So I really worked uh, too hard to enter the school because perfume, uh, I mean, the perfume industry was um, totally new for me. I mean, I was really um, uh, sensitive about the perfumes, but most likely uh, the, the smells in general, like the smells of the paper, uh, the books, um, the, even the laundry that you have on, on your clothes. Mm -hmm. uh, but I didn't consider it as a, a future uh, job, future position at first. And so I studied uh, <clears throat> the, um, the, the perfume industry and the, 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 the world, I mean, of perfume to uh, enter the school, you know, Isipka, that, mm -hmm. is, uh, that, that was founded by uh, Guerlain in France. And so, uh, yeah, I passed the test and then I uh, had the master's so, degree there. So you've been perfuming only for two, two years? I'm confused. You said 20 years ago you started or two I years know. ago? Two years. I'm not that old. <laughs> Come I'm on. Just say, I'm sorry, my bad. <laughs> No, uh, so it was, uh, let me think about it, it was in, yeah, I entered the school in 2006 okay. and lived at 2008. And during the, the, during the school, uh, you, it's like kind of an internship okay. for the two years. And so, so you work on perfumes while you're while so you're So that's studying. how I was trained in at Robote, you know the fragrance company? Okay. Robote? Robote, yes. Yes, Robote. Uh, in grass. Okay. You know, uh, in South yeah, of course, of course. Yes. So that's how it all started. Um, I was uh, trained by a um, um, senior perfumer there that was really, really um, really nice and really, really great and brilliant. And then two years more in Paris, mm -hmm. still at Robert in Paris. So I spent four years there, and then I uh, decided to uh, start on my own and found my own company. Uh, it's been two years and a half. What's ago. it called? Uh, it's the same. It's my name so uh, and something with uh, like LNC in French. Okay. <laughs> So, um, will you ever put out your own line under your own name? No, no. How many? How many do you have out now? You have you. Uh, now 
Uh, you have quite a, a yeah, resume it's at the moment. Thirty fragrances. That's that a lot. Because I do candles also. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. I love the Suleiko line. It's a Russian-inspired new line that's not yes. in the states yet, but great stuff. I sampled them all. They lasted overnight. Really excellent. Yeah, that's kind of the, the point. I mean, it's it's really important for my clients to have really, uh, of course, beautiful perfumes, but also really long-lasting and Longevity, have yes. a sillage, I mean, a trail. Uh, this is something really, really important. So you've done a lot of niche perfumes. Are there any <laughs> yeah. mainstreams that you've done? Or uh, designer? No, no, I don't think so. Uh, um, Not that you wouldn't, you just haven't Except the candles, yet. because oh, okay. it's kind of different distribution sometimes. For example, I did the whole uh, collection for the, you know, the Palace of Versailles. In yes, of course. Yeah, so they have their, um, um, it's a license uh, for mm -hmm. the, the, the candles, and I did the eight cand scented candles for them, yes. So we're going to do a little first impressions here. Cecile was kind enough to bring some of her perfume for me. So what have we got here? <clears throat> so we got Nuit Andalouse from... Nuit Andalouse from MDCI. Nuit Yes, uh, right. from MDCI. Should What's, I? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um. Okay. Oh. <gasps> wow. Oh, I'm no. sorry. It's okay. You're going to smell we, it we, all day. I'm so... <laughs> <laughs> this is a floral. Yes, I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> I'm going to be a walking flower all yes, day. Yes, exactly. Gardenia, what is this? Or, or yes, two rows? Gardenia and jasmine and ylang. Okay. <laughs> Very pretty. <laughs> You're going to remember it. Yes. Right? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Here you have it live. I got perfume poured on me by Cecile Zeroki and herself. It's like you emerged in okay. New Orleans. <laughs> so now we're going to try... Um, Cash Noir. Uh, Cash Noir from Laboratorio Olfativo. And we're going to try not to spill it this time. Yeah, maybe it's better if you... <laughs> I'm going to hold it. and <laughs> So that way <laughs> it will be better. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's quite all right. <laughs> it's not like I've never done this. One time I did it with a black worker once. Oh, okay. At least you're going to experience it for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. <laughs> Cashmere, Oriental, definitely Middle Eastern type um, uh, Oriental. I don't know. I'm not sure. Uh, I mean, of course, it can. I think uh, people of the Middle East can uh, can uh, love it, but I'm not sure it's really, really that oriented. Mm -hmm. I mean, it is Oriental, but you know, like some. I knew I was, when I was reading about this. I knew I was going to like it. This is <laughs> so my style. Oh, thank you. Anything else we have? Um, She's got a whole bag full of stuff here. <laughs> Do you want to try this one? It's going to be a Twisted Lily suit. Twisted Lily, what's this called? Uh, it's uh, the brand is, uh, it's an Italian brand that is called uh, Mask, Mask Fragrance. And this one is called Tango. Tango. Yeah. Very nice. Thank you. you. You definitely have a style. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it, it's um, it's thick and lush, but not loud. Uh -huh. You know, you're, you're good. I like that a lot. <laughs> thank you. Like thank you lot. so much. Maybe one day when we do a good smell as a uh, fragrance, uh, maybe you'll yeah, we'll look you up. Sure. All right. Thanks so much again. That's Appreciate good. it. Thank Thanks you. for the dousing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs>